one. The first responders on the other line are there to make sure that you get the help that you need in times of emergency. And it can be a demanding job. Dispatchers at Metrocom and Corpus Christi typically answer an average of 50,000 calls per month. That's a lot. And that's why the department is making sure that it has enough people to meet the need as it continues to find new ways to expand and improve their services. Our Bill Churchwell joins us now with that story. Bill? Dispatchers are in high demand right now as Corpus Christi sees the same challenges so many others across the country are facing. A big part of the reason why is the stress of the job itself, but it's a job Deputy Chief Christopher White says can also be rewarding. When a call comes in, Corpus Christi 911. it's the folks in Metrocom at CCPD headquarters who are there to answer those emergencies 24-7. But there are a few seats that need to be filled. Like all other Metrocoms across the nation, we are short-staffed. Deputy Chief Christopher White says there are 64 total positions within the department, 13 of those currently are vacant. We are recruiting, we are hiring. Metrocom covers a large area, not only handling calls for Corpus Christi, but also parts of Nueces County, including the cities of Bishop and Driscoll. And our policy down here is within one or two rings, we gotta get that 911 call answered. Deputy Chief White says new employees are trained in-house. 911 call taking is its own entity. Once you, know, once you learn that, then we move you to the dispatch side and you learn the law enforcement dispatch, fire dispatch. 911, what's your emergency? Metrocom is also making sure to keep up with new technology that can serve as an advantage, such as adding texting to their 911 service for those folks who are not able to make a voice call during an emergency situation. We've had that for about a year and a half now. Uh, and we do average about, I think last year we had a hundred and something text to 911. White says it's an option that some people still aren't familiar with and they're not done upgrading. The department's 911 call center is working to integrate what's called the next gen 911 system, which will allow you to also send videos and pictures to dispatchers. Bringing that technology in to, to a Metricom is essential for us to keep up with the times. And for those of you who are interested in becoming a dispatcher, the salary ranges anywhere between $20 and $25 an hour. You can apply on the city's website as well as check out other requirements for the job. Back to you. All right, Bill, thank you for that report. Well, some